Tariq Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the Crown Prince of Dubai and Chairman of the Executive Council of Dubai. Um, so the floor will now be given to a message from His Highness. Your Excellency, Antonio Guterres, Secretary General of the United Nations. Your Excellencies, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. I would like to start by congratulating the United Nations, led by Your Excellency, on the launch of the Roadmap on Digital Cooperation. This important initiative will increase cooperation between governments and encourage support for the private sector, international organizations, and individuals around the world. United Arab Emirates is fully committed to any initiative that increases global dialogues and is a keen supporter of the United Nations. I would also like to express my solidarity of those suffering from the health, social and economic impact of COVID-19. And to the families of those who have lost their lives because of this global pandemic. In the last three months, the world has witnessed a phase in history that will be discussed in history books. We have witnessed tremendous challenge and vast progress at the same time. And we have all seen the problem of not making our governments, system and policies agile and ready for any upcoming disruption, whether it's good or bad. One lesson that I would like to share with you all today is the importance of investing for the future, investing for what is to come, not what is already here. The government of United Arab Emirates, under the leadership of His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, has invested for 20 continuous years, which enabled us to continue operations 100% in the public sector with virtual work measures. The pandemic has also highlighted to all of us that we must not operate in isolation, that no country is better off on its own. If there were a time that we needed to focus on building bigger, stronger, and more resilient bridges, it is today. There are still many opportunities for us to push forward digital cooperations. More than 46% of the world is still offline, and we need to accelerate the effort needed to connect nearly half of the world. Through this pandemic, we have seen that it is possible for us to accelerate the progress of any issue or task. Governments globally pushed three years worth of development to be done in the past three months, so we know that it is possible. We are also seeing the beginning of new challenges and new conflicts, ones that will never seen in the physical world until after the damage is done. I would like to conclude by sharing a model of thinking that we use in Dubai, one that is even more relevant today for every individual organization and government. In the UAE, we are committed to always disrupting ourselves and have a thought process that always requires us to shape the future today. We know that disruption is coming and the need of accelerate our development ensures that we keep moving forward and that we leave no one behind. On behalf of the people of the United Arab Emirates, we welcome the United Nations efforts on bringing the international community together for a better future. Stay safe and I look forward to seeing you all in person in the near future. Thank you for your time.